welcome to another video let's prove that they are both equals to the second one um, but if you have y prime is known as the y dx and which is still the same thing as y dot all these they are derivatives to start with we have x to the power of y equals to exponential x minus y for this we are going to introduce the natural logarithm to both sides to take all the power down and cancel where necessary then we have ln of exponential x to the power y equals to ln exponential x minus y according to the rules of logarithm the power will come down and here we have y ln x equals to the logarithm and exponential they are in fact they cancel and we have x minus y then we have y here i will take it here and by doing that we have uh, plus y here plus y here and if these two negate each other we have this as y ln x plus y equals to x we have y common here and by taking y out uh, we have ln x plus 1 everything equals to x and by making y the subject we have ln x plus 1 uh, divided by ln x plus 1 and by going this we have y equals to x divided by ln x plus 1 if we start this but the question states obtain the derivative of this which is the y dx y prime and to do that we start differentiating but this one is a quotient form and uh, we call this one u and this one is phi so which means we are going to apply the quotient rule formula to solve this but what does quotient rule state if you have y prime everything equals to we keep phi we differentiate u minus then we keep u we differentiate phi all divided by phi square and if you have y prime equals to and what is phi uh the phi here is ln x plus one and uh, by writing it we have ln of x plus one then we bracket it and what does this u prime represent it means we differentiate with respect to x that is u prime is the u divided by the x and likewise to phi prime it means the phi divided by the x that is differentiating with respect to x where x is independent and u is dependent variable and by differentiating x here which is our u we have one minus then u as well is x bracket y phi prime is we want to differentiate ln x plus one and if you have the divided by the x of ln x uh this is more of one divided by x and uh if you differentiate uh a constant value let's say one this is zero so the derivative of any constant value is zero as one here is constant and any constant you have so it is one and by placing it here we have derivative of ln x is one of our x and for the one is zero and everything divided by uh the phi x ln x plus one everything raised to the power of two then uh y prime equals to if i open the bracket we have ln x plus one minus uh, by opening the bracket as well x multiplied by one that is x divided by x and x times zero is still zero everything divided by ln x 
plus 1 all raised to the power of 2. Then from the above, if you have y prime equals to ln of x plus 1 minus s and uh, s will go that is 1 uh, all divided by ln x plus 1 all raised to the power of 2. So plus 1 minus 1 is 0 and we have y prime equals to ln x divided by ln x plus 1 all raised to the power of 2. And here is what we are asked to prove from the given questions. So it's just simple as this and this approach is very simple to understand. Um, I hope you enjoying this video and you don't forget the step I used. Subscribe to this channel and like this video and I will see you in the next class. Remember learning never end and do not stop learning. Thanks for watching.